we would like to take this frequency table, get a mean or an average, and then get a median, which would be the middle score. Now, if we didn't have the frequency, it looks like the middle score would be between two and three, but depending on how the frequency works out, it may not. So what I'm gonna do is take this table and I'm going to rewrite it in uh, expanded form. So I'm gonna expand the table. All right, so zero people had a three. Oh, three people had a zero, okay. So we have three zeros. Next up, one person had a one. So there is one, one. Next up, there's five twos. Five twos, three threes. Do not do this method if your table has really high frequencies, like 15 or 20. Uh, you can do the second part, which is what I'll get into, if you have a larger number, larger frequencies. So four fours and five fives. All right, so if I wanted to get a average or a mean, let's get this out of the way. For the average, I need the total. All right, so the total is, add them all up, zero, 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 plus one, plus two, 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 another two, five twos, three threes, oops, four fours, Three, four, and five fives. All right, I was worried I was going to run out of room, but it looks like I ended perfectly. All right, this is a little bit of a crazy way to write the sum out. It's a lot of numbers written out. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to summarize the sum. So zero, 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 I could write that as three times zero. There's three zeros, plus there's one, one, plus... Uh, now, the number inside the parenthesis is the one I'm going to increase by one each time. So there's five twos plus three threes. These ones are kind of easy. As to should I write the three, the parenthesis here out front? Well, they're both threes. This one is the number in the parentheses is going up by one each time. So how many fives do we have? We have five fives. All right, add all this together. Zero plus one plus 10 plus nine is 20 plus 16 is a lot. 36 plus 25, I don't know. Maybe I'll figure it out. One carrier one, three and two and one is six, 61. All right, that's our average. It's not the mean yet. Average is the total divided by the number. How many are there? Well, we could count the number of numbers that I wrote down here, but that's a lot. What we can also do is add up the frequencies. That's how many times each number appeared. You could get those by saying, oh, three and one and four going across like that. I'm just gonna grab the total right here off the frequency. So three and one is four and five is nine, 10, 11, 12, and four is 16 plus five is 21 total. I hope that's right. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21. All right, got 21 a second time. So 61 over 21 is the average. Uh, when I uncover this, I think I'm going to see the decimal. So 61 over 21, we'll type that into the calculator. Uh, 
2.904. Perfect. All right. How do we get the median? All right. So the median is the middle score. We could actually use a few different things. I think you could certainly use the table, but what I'm going to do is I'm going to use the laid out numbers right here. I get all the numbers in front of me. We have 21. So there's a couple ways to do it. Uh, one way is you can just cross off a number on each side until you get to the middle. We'll do two at a time. Let's get crazy. Look at that. There's a three right in the middle. All right. If you have two numbers in the middle, you average the two numbers. So we have three for that. Now you could have done that on the frequency table, but you have to use a little more imagination. So how I might go about doing it here, the three, the one and the, so there's four right there, which sort of cancels the five down to a one. So now the four and the one makes five, cancels that five, and now that three is in the middle. And so it's one of the threes. But I think that's quite a bit tricky, or more tricky, and also you need to use a lot of imagination. I could have done it on the table here where I just kind of crossed out numbers like this until I met in the middle. That would have worked just fine too. Oh, and I should show you that that's three. <laughs> 